Under Armour has the mo, but sometimes you just have to go. Yesterday, I sold half of breakout stocks holdings in Under Armour, locking in a gain of 39% from mid-December, even though I think that the company's fundamentals are on fire. I love the company's positioning and believe it will become a dominant global sports apparel manufacturer. But I sold the stock on valuation, with the stock trading at 63 times 2014 earnings. The potential growth in international markets is the key catalyst for this investment. Management believes that international revenues, which compose just 6% of sales in the fourth quarter, will account for 12% of sales by 2016, with the goal of ultimately driving half of its sales overseas. This up-and-coming brand name is also aggressively growing its business by focusing on footwear, women's, and youth apparel. I absolutely hate selling a stock on valuation basis alone because I know that the momentum in the stock can keep it sailing along as the company offers growth that many others can't and therefore trades with some growth premium scarcity value. For that reason, I kept half of the position, which I'll call my core position, and I'll look to trade the stock opportunistically, actively looking to repurchase the shares should I get an opportunity to pick up some lower on a broader market sell-off. I'm Brian Ashenberg with The Street.